Welcome everyone to Devo's Wing Chronicles. I am that dude, Devo. The one that you've heard about, probably. Yeah, that's me. Hey guys, if you've never been in here before, please hit that like button, the subscription, and then the bell. It would be greatly appreciated. That's called the trifecta, and that means you're locked in. You know one will pop up. It's a good thing. To all you new subscribers, oh, peace, love, and weed. For me, old Devo and Upstate, we love you guys, man. Thank you so much. And, uh, hey, man, uh, please tell a friend. Tell your mama. Tell your uncles. Write it on the wall. Just spread me around. Share me, please. Share me like VD back in the 70s. Boy, I'll get a lot of subs like that if it was that way. Just spread me around if you can. It'd be greatly appreciated. Okay. This is the portion of the video. Oh, excuse me. That I like to tell everyone or ask everyone. Smoke them if you got them, guys. All right. I'm going to get right into this. This happened to me back, oh, man, quite a ways back. I wasn't even on YouTube, okay? Um, you guys remember when Joe Biden was running for president against, uh, yeah, and do you remember, guys, when he his dog tripped him and he twisted his ankle? Okay, keep that in mind. Well, uh, before I did YouTube, uh, I uh, I played a lot of video games, which you know a lot of people do. But I was into NASCAR. I have the steering wheel. I have you know a, a, a makeshift simulator in front of an eighty inch screen TV. So it's kind of like being in the real car driving it's a blast man with the headset on you're talking to people and racing with people all over the world I ain't kidding you man there have been times man i'll be racing with people that oh, spoke a language that i didn't understand and uh they were heated uh i didn't like the way we were racing them but hey you know come on it's a game but anyway saying that like I, I raced against guys from uh, Australia. I raced against guys from Saudi Arabia, not Saudi Arabia, um, Dubai. That's it, Dubai. I raced against guys from uh, Scotland, England, Ireland, uh, everywhere, man. All right, Canada, Canada. There's a lot of Canadians, man, that like the game, okay? All right, well, this particular time, it was back then, and uh, whenever old, uh, old Slow Joe was running, okay? And, uh, we were racing one night and, uh, you know, I don't talk much, but you have to have a headset on because they want you to be held accountable to voice, you know, Hey man, why are you running like that? You'd be able to speak to them. If you don't have a mic before we even race, if you got to go, yep, I got a mic. You know, when they call your name, you're booted, you're booted off the track because you got to be able to speak. You know, why are you on my butt? Why are you rubbing me? Why are you bumping me? What kind of setup you got in your car, man? Because I can't catch you. That kind of stuff. You know, so we're BSing back and forth. I acknowledge that I have a mic. Talking to these cats via the, wow, PlayStation. Whoa. Hang on, man. Hang on. Good. That, that was a really good hit. I got my medicine at Two Rivers Cannabis Company, Gore, Oklahoma. Whew. Notorious is the name of the brand. It's an indica. Go get it all. Got to have a medical license, though. I ain't joking. All right. Goodness. All right. Like I said, I'm racing with all these different people. Okay. And this happened to be a Thursday evening at three o'clock in the morning. Okay. Here I am racing. Uh, you know, it's late, man, but I can't sleep. Uh, you know, I was on some weird medication at the time or something, or I don't remember, steroid or something. I can't remember. But anyway, I was awake. My, 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 I got into some sativa. You know what I'm saying? Anyhow, 
I'm awake three in the morning and I'm racing. You know, having a blast, just kick back. A long race too, man. Like, you know, we ran r races like you would for real. Where you had to pit, you had to change your tire pressure. You set your car up, man, you know, to run long distances. You can get careful, man. You use your tires up and we'll crash. I ain't kidding you. This is like a real car. You gotta set it up. Anyway, these guys are chatting back and forth, you know. Hey, so and so, and hey, so and so, and, you know, and they're just, they're talking back and forth. Kind of like how me and Upstate are when we're playing golf, right? So I'm just racing. I'm running way in the back. Ain't no, I ain't no threat to nobody. I'm just trying to get, uh, make it to the next pit because my car is jacked up. You know, talking about burning your tires off and wrecking. Yeah. So I'm trying to hold my car together, get it to the pit, right? So you don't want to pit early. It, it really screws everything up if you pit early. So I'm lagging behind. These guys are talking, man. They're up front, up there bumping each other and running. All of a sudden, one of them goes, all right, and remember, this is the Thursday evening, okay, actually Friday morning, but it's Thursday night at 3 o'clock in the morning for me here in Oklahoma. He goes, hey, man, did you hear about oh, uh, Joe Biden? And he goes, who? He goes, you know, Joe Biden, the guy's running against Trump. No, what happened? Did he die? He goes, no, man, he didn't die. He said, man, his dog tripped him and he broke his ankle or something. And he's just kind of, that's funny. In my mind, I'm listening to it driving. I'm thinking, that's weird. I haven't heard anything about that. I'll turn the news on when I'm done and see if I hear anything about it. You can't believe everything here on the internet. So I'm driving, the race is over. I lose, man, big time. I didn't even play. I think I was five laps down. Anyway. I have to flip on the news, man, start flipping through there. Nothing. Next day, me and the wife, it's Friday, right? We go get groceries that evening. We're driving, cruising down the road, you know, and I'm sitting there thinking about that. I said, hey, babe, did you hear anything about, you know, Joe Biden breaking his ankle, twisting his ankle or something? <laughs> no. Why? I said, I told her the story. I said, man, these two Canadians were talking last night and said, you know, hey, Joe Biden broke his, twisted his ankle or something. I said, I haven't seen anything on the news or anything. I said, man, they're probably just BS. And you know how it is. Probably. You can't believe everything you hear on the internet. Well, ain't that true? So we're cruising. We go do what we do. We get back. That night I'm racing again. Never did hear those guys again. Never did hear, see these guys again. On, on, you know, when, when you race, you'll see their names and stuff. Never to see these cats. These cats had some high numbers. You know, if you put up high numbers and race a bunch of times, you stay up in this little category and you can kind of keep track of these people. I'm never there. I am never there. Trust me. All of a sudden I told her, I said, Hey, you know, I told her the story. And she said, man, that's weird. That's, no, I didn't hear nothing about it. We get back. That's Friday evening. We put everything up. We're watching the news. Nothing. The very next morning, which was a Saturday. Breaking news. Joe Biden's dog trips him and he twisted his ankle. But he's okay. How did I know about that two days before it happened? Time travelers? <clears throat> I don't know, man. That's so freaking weird. Yeah. I don't know. Man, no one would, be, would believe me if I hadn't have told my wife about it. Thank goodness that I, we discussed this that day before, or I wouldn't have any proof. <laughs> Weird, man. I know. I know. Hey, guys, if you like these stories, please hit like and subscribe. And remember, guys, be kind to one another, y'all. Come on, for real. L-O-V-E. That is the key. And until next time, guys, you know, keep smoking, baby.